turn three. He does for the moment. Then Zilich is there still in his tire tracks. Three car links back is Justin Allgaier. Behind him, Austin Hill to the inside of Sam Mayer. Ten laps to go. Austin Hill is going to work on Sam Mayer. Had a run coming off the corner. Wasn't there in the dog leg. He'll try it again. As now, Jesse Love falls into the clutches of Custer. Here comes Cole Custer with a nice launch out of turn number two. Pulls right up to the back bumper of Jesse Love. That's the fight for second. Single digits now. Remain in the season. Up the racetrack goes Jesse Love. Cole Custer looking downstairs. Looking lower is Connor Zilich. That's the battle for second. And it is three cars deep. Jesse Love, Cole Custer, Connor Zilich. Justin Allgaier, four car lengths behind. Love and Custer at the racetrack. Which leaves the inside open for Zilich. Cole Custer in a Chevrolet sandwich right now. He's got Jesse Love ahead of him to his rear bumper is Connor Zilich. They remain in that formation. They do. Jesse Love, everybody, as a matter of fact, the tires going away. Here goes Connor Zilich. Best run he's had yet. He goes to the inside of Cole Custer off the dog leg. Cole Custer trying to hang on to the spot. Connor Zilich is trying to take it away. Zilich goes to the apron. Custer goes to the top of the racetrack. Cole Custer grabs the spot. Now it's Zilich now. There's a race to the back straightaway. Oh, Zilich trying to throw the block on Cole Custer off a of turn number two and couldn't get it done. They're side by side now in three. Now the battle for the championship is nose to tail. Custer, oh, he makes contact with Connor Zilich. Here comes Allgaier to the inside. Three wide position goes back to Cole Custer. Custer will grab the spot. He'll pull away now by two car lengths over Justin Allgaier. Who gets by Zilich? Here's Allgaier. He's looking low on Custer. This is the fight for the title. A shot at the championship right in front of Justin Allgaier. Allgaier all over the back bumper of Custer as they go to three. Coming down to the line. Here goes Justin Allgaier to the inside. Allgaier takes the spot. A thunderous roar comes up from the crowd. Justin Allgaier now goes to the number three spot looking for the championship. In an unbelievable turn of events in Phoenix, Justin Allgaier leads the championship for Cole Custer. His championship nemesis right behind him. Allgaier by one to the back stretch. It's not over just yet. Cole Custer trying to regroup. He only trails Allgaier by a half a car length. Five laps to go in the season. Five laps to go to settle the championship. Right now it belongs to Allgaier from the bottom to the top, back to the bottom, and right now in position to walk off with the championship. Allgaier trying to get away with Custer, but he can't do it. Custer's there with him stride for stride. Lap traffic a factor. Leaders to the low lane on that lap traffic. They'll work their way to the inside of Garrett Smithley. All of these top cars, as well as they exit turn number two, it's still Allgaier and Custer separated by a half a car line. And now Austin Hill has cleared the Connor Zilich car. The three of the four championship four contenders are together on the racetrack. Four laps to go in Phoenix. Justin Allgaier third, Cole Custer in fourth. They're right behind Jesse Love in second, and now Austin Hill is broken free of the traffic. He is trying to join the party as well. Here comes Justin Allgaier. Pulls right up to the back bumper of Jesse Love out of turn number two, trying to create some distance between him and Cole Custer. Riley Herbst leads by a mile. Five seconds. He's trying to win for the very third. Oh, trouble. Turn number three. One car gets turned around and goes up into the outside wall. It's Leland Honeyman. He had contact with Garrett Smithley, and they spin in turn three. Caution is on the speedway. We are headed to overtime in the championship race. Can you believe it? No. I can't. Leland Honeyman gets turned in. Turn number three goes up the racetrack, gently kisses the outside safer barrier. He now refires the car, pulls away. Bad news for Riley Herbst, who had a six-second lead. Bad news for Justin Allgaier, who was in position to win the championship. A great season is going to extend past the advertised distance. Don't go anywhere. This is far from over. Riley Herbst was going to cruise and win this event. Maybe not anymore. We'll get you back to the track in a moment. First, we need to pause 10 seconds for station identification on the Motor Racing Network.